light snow, blowing snow going on right now. Expect that for the morning commute. A wind chill advisory that will go into effect tonight into tomorrow morning and staying fairly cold for the rest of the week, though. By the end of my seven day forecast, I think you'll like some of the temperatures right now. Winter weather advisory in effect all of eastern Nebraska, southwest Iowa and northwest Missouri. So any county in the purple expect slick conditions for your morning drive. We had a little bit of freezing drizzle overnight and then some snow now early on this morning, though the little burst of snow we had earlier in the metro. Well, starting to lighten up a bit, but still some snowflakes coming down here as we uh, approach 630 visibility still a mile at Epley now. Just under two in Red Oak. More off to our south in southwest Iowa. Uh, more of freezing drizzle, some freezing mist possible, mixing in with some snowflakes now. Uh, better icing threat will be in Iowa as we go through the remainder of the morning. Mainly light snow here in Omaha through 7, 8, 9 o'clock, and then most of that is gone. We dry out as we go through the second half of the morning, but staying plenty cold. So additional snow, maybe around a half an inch here in the Omaha Metro. Again, some a light glaze of ice possible, mainly in Iowa. We've already had ours earlier today, and then the higher snow totals are going to stay well off to our north. Visibility improving, though still low. We can make out the lights there at uh, the Village Point Shopping Center from Methodist Women's Hospital. Earlier, we could not see it as we had that burst of snow come through. Still some snowflakes coming down at Epley, 12 degrees, but the wind, it is nasty. 25 miles per hour, making it feel like 8 below zero currently. The air temperature, 1 below zero in Norfolk. And right now, feeling like 25 below zero. So, wind chill advisory in effect out to our west through the morning. Some of those brutal wind chills will move our way later on tonight. But that northwest wind, it is just gross. 30 to 40 mile per hour wind gusts going to stick around not only for the morning, but through the afternoon as well. So, what that means, that's going to keep visibility low. It's going to keep that snow blowing around for the morning drive. Those wind chills below zero, so especially the kids heading back to school uh, at the bus stop, you have to bundle up with these wind chills below zero as well. Even as the snow is long gone by the afternoon, those wind chills still going to hang below zero with those winds. Here's the big system. The southern part of this, we're getting severe weather moving through the Memphis area, western Tennessee, Kentucky, parts of Arkansas, and then more snow up in the Dakotas and Minnesota as we go through the day. So the snow is going to move out quickly as we go through the mid morning. It is possible we could get a few breaks in the clouds, some late day sunshine, but the core of the cold Arctic air is going to settle in overnight tonight, and that's going to prompt the wind chill advisory for a good chunk of the view and air, including the Omaha Metro starting this evening at six o'clock going through noon tomorrow. And yes, feels like temperatures 20 to 30 below zero. That is dangerous cold wind chill could set in as little as 30 minutes. So we've got impacts tomorrow and then more impact weather with another round of light snow possible as we head through the day on Thursday. And then we finally start to calm down, clear out sunshine return, and then we'll get those temperatures back in the 40s by the weekend.